What's up you guys? It's me. Welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, as you guys can see, I am not in my apartment. I am actually at my dad's house. If you guys have been watching my videos for a little bit, I lived in my dad's house for a couple months before moving into my apartment that I live in right now. And I have been using this room essentially like a storage closet for everything that cannot fit into my one bedroom apartment right now. I have so much seasonal decor, it's actually crazy. So I decided today that I was going to reorganize and declutter some of my decorations. I also have overflow of things that did not fit into this apartment. And I even have, if you've been watching for a real long time, I started this a couple of years ago where I would do Halloween series where I would turn in to whatever characters I wanted to to fulfill my childhood dream of wanting to dress up for Halloween that it's time to say goodbye to and just props I have like fake blood spray I have so much stuff at his house so today I decided that I'm literally just gonna declutter reorganize and label literally everything because I did start Christmas shopping which is kind of wild because it's literally August 21st um, but Hobby Lobby has got me in a chokehold right now. I'm currently on the hunt for four more cedar garlands from Hobby Lobby. I got two of them. I need four, so I'm gonna go on a mad goose chase for them. I will be going on Friday to hopefully find the last four that I need. I really wanted six of each garland, so I got that garland and I even ordered the Kirkland Norfolk garland because I already knew going in the store was a no-go for me this year, so I actually already ordered them and they're on the way to my apartment. <laughs> I know, I'm being a little crazy this year, but last year I went shopping in like November and I was very, very sad. So this year we are switching it up. I have a head start to everything. And I also shop for multiple years to come, not just the year that I'm decorating. So aside from Christmas, which is by far the biggest chunk of seasonal decor that I possess, I also have fall decor in here. And like I said, just overstock of everything. So let's get into it. So here's my setup here, <laughs> got my tripod. And I also have some things from Christmas. And I still have a lot of my decorations from this room. I have uh, my TV, you guys can see how long it's been since I've been here. It's very dusty in here. Everything's kind of everywhere. I really want to condense it to my closet um, and then these are just stuffed animals that I've had at my dad's house since I was younger <laughs> and then this is I bought five extra bins the other day so these are Christmas decorations that I recently got and I actually just went to Hobby Lobby like 40 minutes before I started filming this and I got some realistic wreaths. I'm thinking of using flocked one this year. And then I also got like a little leather wreath holder. I really hope this works out because last year I had a beautiful wreath on my apartment door, but the actual material was chopping up my door left and right. It was scratching everything. So hopefully this is a little more subtle because it is like a smooth. But this is what the closet looks like right now. As you can see, there is just stuff everywhere. And actually this little section can be utilized. This is all of my my dad stuff so I'm gonna move that as you can see stuff is just everywhere I really want to condense this and make it very cute um, but this is what we're working with right now I literally have cones in here from when I was doing driver's ed in high school <laughs> this is what it's currently looking like I have all of my stuff over here let's get started I'm going to take everything out I'm it's gonna take so long you guys I'm literally gonna take everything out of the bins take the bins out of here just search everything I definitely have more than I expected. The whole room is filled with boxes right now, but the first step is to take out storage in my closet that's not actually mine, it's my dad's, so I'm gonna pull this out. It's these right here, <laughs> and I'm gonna take it to the spare bedroom. Let's get to separating piles, keep and declutter.
You should have seen it 10 minutes ago before I started splitting it up. I was like, ah, I'm throwing a lot of stuff away today. A lot of one person. Listen, I need it all. I don't care. I need it all. I made a lot of progress. This looks like very organized chaos, but I'm gonna show you guys what I got done. I apologize if it's a little bit dark. This room does not have overhead lighting, as you can see. I have two wreaths here. This one is from last year, and this one is from when I lived here. All the stuff on the bed is anything to do with blankets. I do have some kitchen towels in there that I need to reorganize into these bins, but this is mainly blankets and pillows. These are all trees. <laughs> I have some garland from last year that I'm planning on reusing, so that's in this bag, um, except for this one, actually. I don't want this one. These bins, as you can see, I'm watching Spongebob. Um, I've been watching Spongebob this whole time. Um, I have all of my ornaments, and this is a little sneak peek into my Christmas haul for this year, you guys. I was able to snag two different sizes and multiples of each in all of the velvet ornaments this year from Hobby Lobby. I got this rustic brown. The creams have some candles in there. This is all of the gingerbread stuff from last year. In addition to this cookie jar I never ended up using, I just bought it for a future year. I know I'm gonna wanna do a red theme at some point so I have it here I did think about decluttering it but I don't know I'm still on the fence that's why it's in here I have more ornaments over here this is the dark green smaller I love and then I have a random reindeer here and I have Lucky's reindeer costume and then this light brown of the velvet ornaments this year just picks everywhere and then I have the two cedar garlands that I was talking about that I'm on the hunt for four more of in here this entire section has everything to do with the tree, and with the exception of a couple of things here, like that sign. This belongs in the tree bin, which is right here. This one has all of my seasonal trees. I have two gingerbread trees that I recently got from Hobby Lobby. This one is from HomeSense last year. Just trees everywhere. The ones that are wrapped are from last year, ceramic. I have trees underneath of there, just trees on trees on trees. This is actually all my fall stuff, and I can't believe it's only one little bin. I do have a lot of dishware um, that has to do with fall, and I'm gonna organize that, but I can't believe I only have one lonely bin. I actually wanna go fall decor shopping, but Christmas has just been on the brain. As you guys can see, literally the literally the whole room is Christmas. I do have four new candle holders and that's why they're still wrapped up. I got them from Hobby Lobby. I saw it in a Katie Viney video and had to snag them. So that's what those four things are right there. This is the original closet that everything's going to go back into. This bin is for throwing away or giving away. This one is temporary trash. Sometimes I take the plastic bags out if I need them. And then this is stuff that I'm keeping. I just haven't organized it yet. So we have stuff in here. We have the lanterns, obviously. This bin is empty. All of these bins are empty. And then um, this is just Christmas bedding. This is actually for work. I do events during the holiday season and those are holiday decor, but it's not for me. It's for my events, so I have that up there. But that is the current situation. I started this around three. It's currently about five. I'm gonna take a little food break because I have not eaten all day today. And then I'm actually gonna have dinner with my dad because I know I'm gonna be here for a long time, but we're really gonna get to the nitty gritty, label everything, 
after this food break because it's needed. Into the second phase, I'm going to be organizing everything. I brought index cards to write everything down. So I have index cards, I have a pen to label exactly what's going in each box. And there are a couple of boxes that are broken, so any boxes that are broken I will also be throwing away. Let's get into it. Hey. Next to rock like Mick Foley, yeah. it's Nick Joby, kill him softly, play that shit slowly. slowly. On the keys like Tony, throwing subs, they get toasted about my bread like a hoagie. Yeah. This beat ice cold, look how I ride the Zamboni. Hey. I feel like old Tani, good anywhere you throw me. Right. She eat a Chobani, cause her body getting bony. Yeah. Late night, heavy scrolling, vape light, heavy smoking. Yeah. We got our healthy habits, hey. we've been already growing. Okay. It's like we drowning in them, yeah. it seems the levee's broken. Right. But it's not too late to change them. And refrain from being slaves to the vices that encage them. Hey. I'm writing on this page like I'm throwing hands with Satan. Don't run from all those demons, gotta stand your ground and face them. Sometimes you break, but through destruction comes a renovation. Hey. We all just trying to build a foundation. We all, we all, we all, we all just trying to build a foundation. We all, we all, we all, we all just trying to build a foundation. Yeah. Liquidity dry, I couldn't quit if I tried It's been a ride through all the waves and the tides Little emptiness inside from all them days with the guys Try to mask it, but I know you see the pain in his eyes All the lows and the highs, all the gray in the sky Every reason I should throw away and swallow my pride All my life been like a permanent grind I just deserving my shine And you can't even tell until I push the curtains aside Ay, And it's disturbing behind But yo, y'all love to say it's worse in your mind Still I'm searching to find something that's bigger than a verse or a rhyme Find your wings and then the courage to fly Cause we all We all We all We all We all We all, we all just trying to build a foundation We all We all Yeah We all We all just trying to build a foundation to go again but you ain't picking your phone up why you messing my head up any night any day let me take you away all i need is just saying yeah 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 better nights better days when you're here with me babe cause you're all that i crave so i wonder Too many invitations And the last night was heavy. heavy I need communication Tell me where's your location Used to talk 24-7 Every other second Just to make sure we were up to date Now it's closer to 11 And I ain't hearing nothing I just need to know that you're okay Saying yeah, 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 yeah Better nights, better days When you're here with me, babe Cause you're all I crave So I wonder Where are you? 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 Where are you?
hide away from me When I need you most We got love guaranteed And I have to know Say So hard to reach Just pick up your phone Tell me where you'll be Cause I gotta know It's 8.41 and I'm finally finished I'm about to put everything back into my closet But I'm gonna show you guys the progress that I made So here is the deal This is all my fall decor <laughs> Only two bins I'm taking that back to my house to decorate my apartment for fall Not an accurate sign This is when I was moving <laughs> These are all of the bins Three Six, nine, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. I have fifteen bins total, plus the two falls in the back, so sixteen, seventeen bins all together. And I know that's not going to be the end, but this is the organization that I did. So as you can see, everything is labeled on the tops of these. All of these are my trees. These are the lanterns. I'm putting them in last because. They are glass. Everything on the bed stays here. I'm just gonna remake the bed for my dad's house. And all of these are seasonal pillows that I'm gonna put at the top of my closet. And then that back there is just a bowling pin from like my 13th birthday. I had people sign it and I never got rid of it. It's been sitting here living at my dad's house. So this is everything together. Some dishes inside of my old basket that I used to put my blankets in at my apartment. I have a newer, bigger one now, so I just kept it here. And then down here, we have just overflow random stuff. Some wrapping paper that I'm probably not gonna use, but I still wanna keep it just in case I wanna use it for a background or something. These are seasonal pajamas. Literally y'all, it has been an event of a day, but it's finally coming to a close. So let's finish it out strong. I'm going to actually move my seasonal pajamas because I already know this is going to take up the entire closet. <laughs> This is the final product of the room. This is the baseline for what it normally would look like. Um, I decided to move this out here. This was like just random dishes. I put it in that basket in the side because no one sleeps in here. So I'm gonna leave it there. This is my cards, just put some random pillows on there. And I put all of my trees underneath the desk. These are just extra blankets. This is everything I'm taking right now, which is only two bins. This is for my fall decor for later on. And then across from here, is where the magic is at. So this is the completed closet tour of my storage cabinet, basically. This bag that just holds extra bags because I know I'm gonna have like another bin or two or three after this holiday season. So I know I'm gonna have to do more labeling and printing. These are the lanterns. I don't put them in the bins to prevent breakage. So I just leave them right there. And then this is my event decor. These are the random bins. And then these are the decor pillows. This is my tree collar. This is a hamper full of extra hangers and wrapping paper and just all of the above. These are extra glasses. And this is what it's looking like, you guys. After an entire basically day shift, I completed my decor organization. I feel super, super tired. I feel like a weight is off my shoulders because now I can properly analyze and organize all of my storage. And I got a chance to look through everything that I already have to prevent buying doubles of anything this holiday season because God knows I love to shop, especially when it comes to Christmas. Don't play. Don't play with me with Christmas decor. Ever since getting my apartment, I've really had an appreciation for home decor. And as you can see, it has spiraled. But that is pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching this seasonal decor, declutter, and organization video. And I will see you in my next one. Bye.